Hi, boys and girls. Okay, now today in math, we are talking about um, counting to 30, and we're also practicing one-to-one -one counting. So every time you have one thing, that's one count. And I've been watching some of the videos of y'all um, using the little um, counters or the erasers that, that I gave y'all. And um, you've counted those and crayons and different things. And I see y'all kind of getting in a hurry. And you're trying to count and you'll just go one, two, three, four. And is that four? No, that's not four. No. And so I know this is something that we need to practice on. And we need to get better on that when we're counting we actually touch it and sometimes it's better if we touch it and move it we put it like in a new pile and parents and families i want to say thank you so much because i can tell y'all i've seen y'all go go back and count that again you need to be sure this time touch it and say the number so i really appreciate y'all doing that that's really helpful okay so i'm going to show you something and we're going to start let's see we're gonna count, here we go, are you ready? Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Here we go, keep going. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Put some more on there. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Keep going. 26, 27, 28, 29, and 30, we got to 30. Oh my goodness, look at this. That's a lot of Unifix cubes. Okay, so now each five, I did a separate color. So if I wanted to, I could count by fives. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. That's counting by fives. Okay, I'm gonna take 10 off. So we're just looking at 20, okay? So we're gonna think about, hmm, I wanna think about if something is more than, less than, or the same number as, okay? So this is 20. If I count my fingers on one hand, is that gonna be less than 20, more than 20, or the same number as? What do you think? make a prediction. Well, let's see. Let's count my fingers. One, two, three, four, five. Hmm. Five and 20. Well, let me show you five cubes. Here's five cubes. So is five more than, less than, or the same as. It's less than, look, it's only five, and this is 20. 20 is more than. Five is less than, it's smaller, less. Okay, good job. Now, what if I count the fingers on both of my hands? Is that gonna be more than 20, less than 20, or the same as? I don't know. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, that's ten. Let me show you ten cubes. Here's ten cubes. Here's my twenty again. Let's compare. Well, is ten less than twenty? Is ten more than twenty? Or is 10 
the same as? 10 is less than, because look, you have all these up here that don't have a buddy. So 20 is more, it's more, it's bigger. Yeah, 10 is less than, okay? What if I can't, my toes on both of my feet, now, I'm not going to show you my toes, but if I count my toes and I count my fingers, hmm, how many toes do we have on each foot? We have five toes, okay? So, I'll just go like this for like a little toe. I'm going to practice. Okay, you have to do it with me. I'm not going to practice. We're just going to do it, okay? It's going to be like a pretend foot right here, okay? This is pretend. One, two three, four, five, now this foot, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, now my fingers, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So I counted all of my fingers and toes. Oh my goodness gracious. Let's see. Okay, so that's 20. Okay. 5, 10, 15, 20. Okay, and here is my original stick of cubes. Let's compare. Well, are they the same? Is one more than or less than or the same as? Bobcats at this time. That's Mr. Ames. <laughs> he's pretty perky, isn't he? Yeah, he's pretty happy sounding. Okay, so it's the same as. Good, look. It's the same. It's the same exact row. Same. Nothing's sticking up. Nothing's down below. So the 20 cubes I started out with is the same when I counted my hands all my fingers and all my toes. Wow, we finally have one that's the same number as. Wow, how cool is that? Very awesome, okay. So what if I count, hmm, my fingers, my toes, and hmm, what if I, had Miss Barker, who's the pair who's usually in here with us, and I had Miss Barker hold up one hand. Okay, well, let's practice. Let's do it. I mean, okay, here's a foot. One, two, three, four, five, another foot. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Here's a hand. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Now, here's a pretend hand of Miss Barker. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. 25. Okay. So, have to add five more here. So, here's 25. And here's my original stick, my 20. Trying to get this even here. Okay, so now, is the 25, is it the same as, the same number as this row, this stick? Is it less than or more than? This is the row I'm talking about right here. Is this, remember, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. I counted by fives. And this one is 5, 10, 15, 20. I counted by fives, and this one has 20. This one has 25. 25 is more than, and the 20 is less than, right? Yeah, good job. Okay, so that's what we were doing today, talking about more than, less than, okay? So when, we, when you're putting things in a row or you're counting things out during the day, you can talk about this is more than, 
This is less than, or this is the same number as. If you're helping to set the table, you can say, oh, we need the same number of plates as forks, yeah. Or if we need less forks as plates. I don't know, maybe someone usually uses a spoon. I don't know. <laughs> okay, and your homework today is gonna be out of your packet. It's the gumball page. It's more or less. And you're gonna color the gumball machine that has more gumballs in each picture. You're gonna color the one that has more. Now, it would be great if you could use your pencil. Let me find my pencil. Why does my pencil always grow legs during the day? I do not know why this happens. But it'd be great if you could write the number beside each gumball machine. So this one, one, two. I crossed it out as I counted, so I'm gonna write my two over here. Now on this gumball machine, I'm gonna have to have a little help because the circles are small. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, students should be at their dismissal areas. Again, at this time, all students should be at their dismissal areas. Thank you. Okay, so I crossed each gumball out and I counted it. So families, you're gonna probably need to help so you know that they're counting one number to each little circle, each gumball. And remember, you wanna color the machine that has more. Which one is more, nine or two? If you're not sure, look on the number line. Here's two and here's nine. Which one is farther down the line? Nine is all the way down here. It's more, it's bigger. Two is way down here. Okay, so nine is bigger. You'll color nine. So, here we go. I colored it. Okay, so that is your homework. And then send it to me, okay? Great job, guys. Talk to you later. Bye.